Have you got an update on Balagon for us? Because there's lots of talk going on about America and the England and whatever. No, there's, there's no updates. Um, like, like I said on on um, match day minus one yesterday. Was it? Was mm. day four? Um, yeah, we spoke to Flo. Flo was, you know, re, you know, pulled out with with a with a slight um, hamstring strain. Um, the plan is that I'll go over to to France and speak to him. Hopefully, hopefully, um, nothing's changed. He didn't give me any inclination that that's anything had. So. Um, yeah, hopefully that's the case. You go over to speak to him, and is that a recruitment mission? What do you What do you do? Wear as much England gear as you possibly no, can. No, it's more more. Uh, no, it's more more just a bit a bit of support as well. To be honest, I mean, I've, I go. We've we've got uh, two or three lads that, that play in the French league, so I'll go over anyway. But I will make a point of making sure that you know we, that we meet up and that, that we have a chat and just you know if, if he need, if he needs reassuring or if he needs any kind of support, he'll get it. Um, you know, ultimately we we uh, we really. You know, we, we love having Flo with us. We think he's got a lot of potential, and hopefully that, that continues. And just on Emil, great goal, great header. Yeah. How does it see him back playing football after a difficult couple of three months of injury? Yeah, I, th I think now it's just a case of Emil, you know, getting the minutes now and getting the uh, getting his confidence back. That is, you know, that you know his, his body's capable now of, of, of not only training but playing. You know, we've seen we've seen flashes tonight. You know, he's still there's a lot more to come from Emil. We've seen. We've seen him. Um, we've seen him be outstanding at times, and you know he had flashes tonight where he was very good. Um, and a big, 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 uh, big plus for Arsenal.